I do not like the way Wisconsin has played against the number at home recently. I don't know if it's a false sense of security or just the pressure of performing in front of their home crowd. Michigan has much more to lose here being on the bubble. With Illinois and Michigan State coming up shortly, Michigan will be best served to snag a win here than rely on trying to knock both of them off. In a game that should be extremely tight, I prefer taking the points. So I will take the points, plus two and a half, and go with Michigan in this one. But the total I am liking a little more than the side, so I would prefer to go with the total. If you want to play the side, go Michigan plus two and a half. Uh, for the total though, the Michigan offense really clicked in their last two wins as they scored 82 and 84 respectively. Michigan has gone over the total in four of their five road games in which they were underdogs, and the Badgers have gone over in 11 of their 18 games in which they were favorites. I expect this game to open up a bit after what could be a slower start. So hitting this one live if we do in fact have a slow start. I'm going to go over the total which is currently at 138 and a half. Again the two plays for this one. If you want to play a side I prefer the uh, total though. But the side Michigan plus two and a half and over 138 and a half. What say you? Let me know in the comment section below. As always, Taylor Fade, may the winner be yours. We're all here for the same reason, to get that cash, smash that bookie where it hurts. You know where that is. We'll see you in the next one. This is Trending Rabbit.